Hey guys, welcome to another episode of TLA. This week I am at Lake Berryessa. Beautiful, beautiful place up in Northern California. And I love this lake, it's such a beautiful lake. And I'm really excited to be out here today to catch some landlocked salmon or maybe some crappie um, and even some trout and bass. These are all species that exist here in Lake Berryessa and it's a great place to, to target them. So um, I'm gonna go out there and give it a shot. There is some shad that's available here in this area and if you can pull some up, which I'm going to try to do, and then send them out, that's the natural feed that a lot of these fish are feeding on. And so I'm gonna give it a shot and throw it out there and hopefully I'll get something that's gonna take it um, to, to try to get their attention and get something to bite. But it's an exciting fishery here in Northern California. Lake Berryess is a beautiful, beautiful place to, to go fishing. And if you ever wanna try it, this is the Looks like Ming already, uh, looks like my buddy already hooked up a fish already. Looks like he got one in the boat just like, like a minute ago. So, um, and I saw another kayaker get him. I saw another boat get him. So I know that they're actually biting right now. So that means I'm a slow poke, right? I'm a slow poke when it comes to all this stuff. <clears throat> I saw you catch that fish. Two. Man, I'm slow to the game. Okay, I'm gonna stop the video right here and do a disclaimer. If you are a bass enthusiast and I know there's a big community out there, just skip on past this section. Me and bass are not the best of friends. I don't like them, they don't like me. We have come to a mutual understanding that I'm going to verbally bash them if they take my bait, but they will be released unharmed rather than get fried in the pan. So I think that's a good deal for both parties here. Bro, it's a bass. It's a bass. It's a bass. Look, it's a bass. Yeah, I love that bass, baby. Who likes bass? Who likes bass? I mean, TLA. Does TLA like bass? Sure, seems sure like sure, seem sure like it. I'm getting a lot of bass photos. Here. I don't know. It could be a bass. Could be a bass. <laughs> No! Oh, I hate bass! Ah. Oh. Green hoochies and bass. Look at that, boys and girls. Oh, so Look at that. Bass. Bass, bass, bass. Go home. Moving on. So, I put my flasher on and that definitely got the action moving. A bat! Jesus Christ, it's a bat! It's a bat! Look at that. Ah! Oh. Ah! Oh. oh, this is just...
So after a long morning of just a lot of bass action, I finally got the hit that I was looking for. It's fights like a salmon too. Yeah, on our officials. I got fish on. Yeah. Now look at that, it's a salmon. All right. Got a salmon. Yay! We ain't hooked it up. Wow, looks just like a salmon. <laughs> it looks just like a salmon. Oh, I caught a, a salmon. It looks just like a salmon. And uh, off this green hoochie. It's a, 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 it's a, a long locked salmon. And that's actually what it looks like. It looks like just like a salmon, but it's smaller. So that's pretty cool, huh? What you think about that? I actually got a bass and now I got a salmon. So it's pretty exciting stuff. This is a new territory for me here. So I'm gonna cut this guy up and, and move this guy around. Just caught him off this uh this hoochie that, that my buddy gave me. Look at this green hoochie. So Caught a first salmon. Oh, sorry. Hey. So I think that's pretty cool. And they bite early in the morning and then they bite in the afternoon sometime. But uh basically sandwich time at this point. So we're just hanging around. Don't not expecting much at this point, so it's in the afternoon, so that's how usually how it goes. Anyway, so it was there's lots of shad around here, so you just try fishing around the bait ball, just like in the ocean. You might fish around the bait ball, you get hit. Um, so if I could try to find some shad, maybe pull some up and, and send one down. I think that's that's a good solution. I'm still pulling the... Ah, look at that, that's a nice fish. There's another one. This guy just killing the all the big fish, professional. All right, guys, we're back on land. Oh my God, what a day. It was pretty insane. Uh, the morning started off well. I took a little time to, to do my, all my YouTubing stuff, but eventually I got out and I did hook up with a fish. But then uh, by mid afternoon, it slowed down like most fish do in, in about 12 o'clock. But then uh, right around uh, three o'clock-ish, I was talking with a local that fishes here a lot and he says right around three o'clock-ish until about five, uh, the fish come back and, and they came back hard. And so for two people, we did it. We got it done. Oh, yeah, we got it done. That's a that's a beautiful stringer right there for for two people. So that's uh, my friend Ming, and he uh, he he killed it today. And he's and I got some footage of that. You guys can see that. But um, yeah, and so that that was an excellent uh, day of fishing. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video as well. So there you go. That's it. Now we're we're gonna start migrating over to the salt pretty soon in the next few days. So all right, guys, if you like it, make sure you hit subscribe comment and share. Check it out.